Hey guys, it's Jamie from No Getting Off This Train, and today I'm going to show you how to make breakfast bowls that you can put in your freezer. This recipe is part of my 25 Days of Freezer Meal series. If you need to get caught up, just check out the link in the description below. So if you've followed me for any length of time, you know that I love doing meal prep on Sunday afternoons. I'll set Allison up with a movie for about an hour and a half, I'll get into the kitchen, and I will make all of our breakfast, snacks, and whatever else we need for the entire week. So this helps us in a couple of ways. One, it saves me money because I'm not going out and buying other things for me to eat because there's no food in the house to eat. And secondly, it's just a lot healthier. I can control what ingredients are going into my food Food, and it's just a lot healthier that way. Now this breakfast bowl that I'm about to show you is a really good healthy meal prep recipe. It is full of protein from the eggs and the turkey sausage. You also got potatoes and you have different kinds of vegetables. I put onions and green pepper in mine, but you can take those out and replace them with something different. You could use like broccoli or zucchini, any of your favorite vegetables. It also has sprinkled cheese on top, so you can customize it in any way you want to. And it makes six servings, so that will last you the entire week. And they're freezer friendly, so you can put them in individual containers and put them in the freezer and just pull them out whenever you're ready to eat. And this takes less than an hour to make. So just imagine you've got at least six meals for the entire week ready in less than an hour. I mean, that's amazing. So let me show you how they're made. Start by preheating your oven to 400 degrees and then slice and chop seven medium red potatoes. Once those are all chopped, put them on a cookie sheet and then spray them with cooking spray, sprinkle with salt and pepper, and then roast them for about 20 minutes. While those are roasting, start cooking one pound of breakfast sausage. I use turkey sausage, but you can use whatever kind you like. Next, chop up one green bell pepper and one medium onion. Once those are diced, you can add them to your sausage to cook right along with it. Next, in a medium bowl, crack open six eggs and put in a splash of milk and whisk them together. Scramble them in a preheated pan until they are just finished scrambling. Once everything is finished cooking, you can now assemble your bowls. Now in six containers, place about a half cup of the potato mixture in each one. As you can see, this is real life. I don't have all of the same containers. It's all right. I had some potatoes left over, so I just put them in a separate container to eat later. After that, put in about a half cup of the meat and vegetable mixture. Next, evenly divide the eggs among the containers. And then lastly, sprinkle with about two tablespoons of shredded cheddar cheese. Once these have fully cooled, place the lids on tightly and put them in the freezer. And when you're ready to eat them, you can take one straight out of the freezer and defrost it for a couple minutes and then microwave it regularly. Or you can thaw one in the fridge overnight and cook it for about one to two minutes in the microwave. If you would like the printable recipe for this, you can find a link in the description below. You can also find the link to my 25 days of freezer meal series if you want more freezer meal ideas. Also, be sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel for more updates for grocery hauls, more recipes, and meal planning tips. 
Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you later.